Hi, I'm Mike from 1A Auto. We've been selling auto parts for over 30 years. What's up guys? In this video I'm going to show you how to top off an AC system. We know this AC system in this 2001 Ford Focus is a little bit low, uh, so we want to top it off. There's probably a leak somewhere, so we're going to top it off with some refrigerant and there's some dye in here. And we're going to need one of these adapters so we can hook it onto the refrigerant, add it to the car. Alright, we're going to start this vehicle up. And we're going to turn the AC on high. AC on high, recirculate. So th this is before we're adding any refrigerant to our vehicle. Uh, coming out of the vents, it's about 86, 85 degrees. All right, when we were gonna hook this up to the hose, we wanna make sure there's a pin in there and it's gonna stab the can. We wanna make sure that pin is all the way screwed out so that it's not pushing down. And we can screw the can on. You want to make sure you're wearing safety glasses when you do this. Snug this up. So our low pressure port is right here. Normally there'd be a shield over here covering it, but this vehicle it's missing. So uh, what we're going to do is we're going to shake the bottle and then we're going to hook it to the low pressure port. Make sure it's snapped on. So you're gonna to wanna to follow the directions that come with the hose and follow the directions on the can. At this point, we're gonna stab the can. We'll tighten this wing nut down and that stabs the can. And then when we're ready to add the refrigerant, we're gonna loosen it up. Gone. We can actually look at the gauge. Now we wanna look at the gauge, where the gauge is at while the compressor's running. You can see the compressor kicking on right here. When that's on, that's the AC pumping. The compressor is pumping the refrigerant, pressurizing it and sending it to the condenser. And then from the condenser, it is going back into the evaporator, which it would be cooling it, and then back to the compressor. So we want it in the green while that's pumping. So I'm gonna loosen this up, and that's gonna send some more refrigerant in there. There we go. Starting to run a lot longer. It's getting closer to the green. There we go. If we had a little bit more, it might be ideal, but at least we're in the green and uh, then we can drive it for a while and then later on check for leaks. So what I'm gonna do at this point, I'm gonna close this valve. That's gonna shut the refrigerant off over here. And I can disconnect the connector. So our AC system's all filled. So I'm gonna just check what's coming out of the, the air ducts and you're at about 56, 55 degrees Fahrenheit, which is good. It's nice and cool on a hot day like today. Thanks for watching. Visit us at 1AAuto.com for quality auto parts, fast and free shipping, and the best customer service in the industry.